My name is Mary, and I represent the employee Pat. I have some questions as part of my cross-examination. Are you ready to go forward with my cross-examination? Yes. You stated during direct exam that Pat was a good employee, correct? Most of the time. In fact, six months before this incident, he received an outstanding evaluation from you, correct? Well, yes, but that was before he found out his wife wanted a divorce. You stated during direct exam that you were his supervisor for three years. During those three years, you gave him nothing but outstanding evaluations, correct? That is true, but as soon as his personal life was out of control, his work life suffered. It was like day and night. In the last six months of Pat's employment, you increased the work level substantially, even though you knew he was having personal problems, correct? Well, the work needs to get completed regardless of our personal lives. I tried to explain that to Pat. Did Pat tell you he was going through a very difficult time and he needed you to cut him some slack? Yes. Did Pat tell you he was in counseling and is on medications for his therapy? Yes. Did Pat also make several requests for a new computer? Yes, but we did not have the budget for any new equipment. So Pat's frustrations were not just about his personal life, but also about your refusal to give him the proper equipment to get his work completed, correct? Pat needed to get with the program and deal with his anger issues on his own time. If you thought Pat had a serious anger issue, why didn't you contact Human Resources about the problem? I was hoping he could work that out with his therapist. Did you tell your supervisor or anyone about your concerns regarding Pat? No. So even though you were the supervisor in the workplace and you saw Pat struggling, you did nothing to help him? I tried to talk to him, but I got nowhere. I'm his supervisor, not his wife. I have no more questions for the witness at this time. Thank you.